Hi, I'm Kat, and I hate horror movies. And today, we're watching Reanimator. I don't know anything about this movie, other than the fact that no doubt there'll be a person who reanimates things. <laughs> Spoilers in the title, am I right? I'm sure that'll go well. I understand that this falls into the classics category, so I'm excited to see another movie that you all love so much and have been really asking me to watch for a long time, so let's get into it. RLJ Entertainment, 18 plus. All right. A disaster right out the gate. <laughs> Points the gun at everybody as he tries to go in. Ha! <sighs> Can't be right. <laughs> He's unwell. Such, such, such. <laughs> of course, he's dead. The dosage was too large. You killed him. No, I did not. I gave him life. Reanimator. He's the reanimator. That was crazy. You don't usually see that much gore right out the gate. Oh, this is Lovecraft. Okay. Okay. Expectations set. Remember when his eyeballs exploded? And then he took the pulse just to be like, is he okay? Is this all about eyes or something? They're obsessed with eyes in this intro. This music kind of reminds me of, uh... Psycho a little bit, eh? Don't open. It'll open. I knew it. Your girl's seen a lot of horror movies now. Miskatonic Medical School, Arkham, Massachusetts. Trying to reanimate the classic way. The old-fashioned way, if you will. Alright, I'm gonna zap her again. Charge up the paddles. Is that what nurses say? Do they say I'm gonna zap her again? Is that what doctors say? She just needs a little more time for the drugs to circulate. Kane, she's gone. Ah. Mr. Kane, say nice. Got another one for you. Remember when people could smoke indoors? I'm far too young to remember that. <laughs> ah, to give it a yep. Yeah. There we go. Grabs him. Oh, he's working hard. Look at that sweat. Uh... I don't know about that. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I'm sorry, Dan. I didn't mean to scare you. Oh, it wasn't too bad, Dean Halsey. I just didn't know anybody was here. This is Herbert West. He'll be joining you in your third year. Trying to research in Switzerland with Dr. Goober shortly before he died. Oh. Mr. West, this is Daniel Kane. He also doesn't like when people die. He worked with Hans Gruber. This is our eminent brain researcher and grant machine, Dr. Carl Hill. Your theory on the location of the will and the brain is... Interesting. <laughs> he was gonna say stupid. And your support of the 12 minute limit on the life of the brainstem after death. Six to 12 minutes. Frankly, Dr. Uh, Hill, your work on brain death is outdated. <clears throat> and uh, looking forward to seeing you in class, Mr. West. He didn't mean that. Go stay. Daddy knows I'm here. I don't care what Dean Halsey knows. The day that you graduate, the minute you get your MD, I'll marry you. Not a minute before. I'm going to have to teach you a lesson, my <laughs> What are you girl. doing? Dad! This is gonna be all too real in like 20 minutes, am I right? Ah, uh, Kat, first I'm never doing, to... Come here! Come, <laughs> come, please. You're on a hereabouts apartment. 
<laughs> yes. Didn't we meet this morning? You're, uh... West. Herbert West. Look at that. Zoom in. Just one second. <laughs> Come in. Thank you. Didn't knock. Just stood at the door. <laughs> Does this building have a basement? Ah, uh, yes. Perfect. Oh, oh, yes. I knew it. Yes. I shall reanimate here. I think this will be just fine. Shall I move in now? You didn't say why you left Switzerland. Out with it. Well, there was no more I could learn there. Tell her about the eye popping. Do we have a deal? Tell her about the blood everywhere. Ah, it'll come out. <sighs> Done. You make the incision at the base of the skull. All right. Okay. Oh, she. And then grasping firmly with both hands. Ah. Forward over the head. Ah. It's very much like feeling a large orange. <laughs> you take the bone saw. Come on. Ah, okay. And you cut around the perimeter. Do they use real cadavers for this movie? You can tell me. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. A brain. The human oh, brain. Oh, she's holding it in. Once these activities cease, the brain can only survive an additional six to 12 minutes. Six to 12 minutes. <laughs> brain death brings about an irreversible. A little bit, right? We all pray for some miracle. Sound. You know, you should have stolen more of Gruber's ideas than at least you'd have ideas. Mr. West! There's got to be a pleasure to fail here. To the foundation. And to Miskatonic. I have a study date. With Daniel? Yeah. Daniel Kane? Mm-hmm. Herbert West has moved in with him, hasn't he? I'll trust him, this doctor. Oh, that must be him. Excuse me. Bye, Daddy. Bye, Daddy's creepy friend. So, your daughter is seeing Kane, eh? You think that's wise? Huh? Could do worse. Hello, sir. <laughs> Dr. Hill? Nice, respectful boy. One last toast. Mm -hmm. The obsession of all who fall under her spell. I hope that guy is, is part of a failed reanimation, you know? His eyeballs can pop out. That'd be fine. No. Please. Studying. Study date. It's not you, really. It's just a lot of little things. Well, West is always in his room with the door closed. No. I mean, do you ever see him? When West comes in, he runs and hides. Rufus runs and hides all the time. It's OK. He's around. I haven't time. even heard him. Usually, he at least knocks something over when I'm here. Rufus, where are you, boy? Here, kitty. Rufus is such a classic pet name. You have a dog, name it Rufus. You got a cat, Rufus. Rufus? I mean, there aren't a lot of rooms that the cat could be in, so it makes sense sh that she would wonder. Don't be weird! Um, Rufus, behind the door! <laughs> this is an invasion of privacy at best. What are you doing in my room? I thought I was going to the private room, Dan. Meg, what the hell are you doing in here? Come here. In the fridge! I was going to show you. Shut up. I was dead when I found him. You killed him. He hated you. Knocked the garbage over and he got its head stuck in a jar. I certainly didn't think you'd want to find it like that. I did not want to stink the place up. I don't think he killed him. I don't think so. He's going to try to reanimate him. That's what a good roommate would do. I think you both better leave now. What the hell is this? My reanimation juice. This is none of my business that you're sleeping with Dean Halsey's daughter. 
You know, I would not want to see a fellow student be thrown out of school, out of the profession, on moral grounds. Well, I think Dr. Halsey just might understand. Oh, are you sure you want to find out? They love to shoot him in a close-up, eh? Really tight close-up. The cat's back, and I hope its eyes don't explode. Herbert. Herbert. Check the basement. Wes, what is that? Just the cat, just a small little cat. Oh. Oh. Oh, all the way down. Oh, ow. Oh, they come back, but they come back mean. This is like Pet Cemetery. If you reanimate, they come back not themselves. Try the pss 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 pss. A piece of it was on the wall, then it fell. It's a puppet. Look out! <laughs> You're a sick man. You're a sick man. Ooh. It's really quite simple. All life is a physical and chemical process. Bang, we have reanimation. The theory is not new, West. But my reagent is. You will help me. No! You've seen the results. No, Rufus wasn't dead to begin with. You lowered his body temperature. He couldn't have been dead. Do you agree that he's dead now? You're gonna bring him back a second time while he's juicy? West, no. How'd they get that to glow in such a way? It's quite, quite lovely. How'd they do that? I'll show you. Then you'll help me. That is why I brought the infernal beast back to life in the first place. Doesn't like cats. You can just say you don't like cats. In the brain? Of course. Oh, Don't expect it to tango. It has a broken back. Who? Who? It was dead. Twice. Ah! What are you doing here? It's, 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 it's impressive. Herbert West has affected reanimation in dead animal tissue. Oh, no. You will, in any case, have your student loan rescinded. Yikes. Harsh. I won't be able to continue school. I said that will be all. Ah, uh, nice boy. I have a feeling he's gonna start feeding that guy cadavers. I mean, they're on the fourth. This is a new frontier, you know? How could you not sort of, I don't know, morally ambiguous, but you know, it's important research, obviously. You gonna be around for a while? Yeah. I might go catch me some uh, coffee. Take your time. Slick. Slick. <laughs> They're not alive yet. Burn, victim. <sighs> Got a hint to the score, right? Whoo! Start the recorder. Start the damn recorder. You can't start the recorder? Make the entry. Captain's log. October 10th. 10th. Early 20s. Uh, Physical condition. Deformities. Looks right down below and says no deformities. 15 cc's. That's a lot of the juice. 15 cc's of reagent being administered. That's a lot of the juice. He loves me. We're getting married. He's mad. I've seen this happen. Medical students before. Dr. Kirby. Dr. Harrod, is Mr. Kane loose in this hospital? Loose. Something should have happened by now. Maybe you need more. More of the... This green stuff. The reanimation juice. Let's get out of here. Obviously the human dosage factor is unknown. I'm a doctor. Herbert, let's go! No! 
Ah, oh, there's an air bubble in there. Ah, well, he'll be reanimated and then immediately die. Mr. Kane will be up soon. You can discuss it then. Don't blame him, Daddy! Ah, she's doing her best. Finish the bottle on him. Let's go. Let's go! All right. Oh, oh so the Jew. So blood. All right. <laughs> Holy, so strong. Ah, well, he is in his 20s. <laughs> So, so... <sighs> Is West in there with you? Yeah. So... Trouble, both of you! <laughs> he crushed his guts! He crushed his ribs! Not good. No, so bad not to do such a thing! Why would you ever in a million years put your stupid fingers in his mouth? <laughs> Everyone's being punished a little bit harsher than they need to be in this movie so far, you know? You know? Just rubbing him against the wall. Just smearing him against it. Just shaking him about. Damn, look out. It's too late for him. He's been smashed about for too long. <laughs> oh, oh, so, so much of it. Oh, it's, eh, it's so much. It needs so much of it. Oh, wow. It's so much. So much. It is so much. I realize that I've said that a few times, but it is a lot. Find the recorder. He left the drill in there. Ha. Huh. Huh. Did you see him then? Huh. He listened to me. It made a conscious act. His fingers. Uh, you may be right. It had probably been dead too long. It wasn't fresh enough. We probably only revived the senses and the instincts. So come on, help me get him. Him, him. Is he dead? Of, of course. Will you give me a hand yeah, here? Yeah, his ribs were crushed. But granted, it was an accident. But this is the freshest body that we could come across. Get in there. Do the th Do it. It's too late now. We can bring him back to life. It's so over between him and his girlfriend, right? Ah! Remember when the door fell on him and you heard... And you heard it? That was gruesome. Just look at this great outfit she's got on. About to get a lot of blood on it. Fifteen seconds, I'll show you. <gasps> so much always blood coming out. Doctor... <gasps> Like, something's amiss in here. The person holding the camera wasn't even on a dolly. They were taking steps back. You could see the camera. That was wild. Meg? What is it? Are you all right? No one's all right. Dan, he's trying to speak the recorder. Always very strong. They come back so strong. Just a, just a corpse. Dean Olsen. I'm calling the police. Holding the gun just like, like this? Not even, <laughs> we respect it. <laughs> he needs a nap. He's seen too much. Don't worry. Does a little flippy move. Oh. Must trust me. I don't even trust that guy's wig. Someone just plopped hair on top of him and combed it to the side. That's not his hair. I want to take a look at the right frontal lobe. I'll open the skull here. I don't want to know. You don't want to give it a day or two to see if it resolves? Ah, just go in. Poke around. You have my blessing. I want you to think of me as someone you can come to with your problems. 
Or if you're ever lonely. There it is. We were all, we were all waiting for that, right? I know you're all by yourself now. So I thought I would prey on you. <gasps> Cut it out, Dad. You're wrecking the mood. I'm going to find out what happened to him. Smash! Smash! Something's gonna happen to this guy and it's not gonna be good. And we're gonna be here for it. What did you do to him? He's not insane. Alright, uh, okay. He's dead. One more slap. You gotta do it in threes, don't you? That's comedy. You're insane! You're insane! I'll tell you, Nick. Everything. Ah, he's a good little actor, isn't he? Good evening, Mr. West. Sorry, new character? No, I just didn't recognize his voice. Why, his pulse is erratic. I've told everything I know to the police. We both know he is quite dead. Interesting little laboratory you have here. Anything I can steal? I want your discovery. I will take your science. I don't do my own science. Kill him or something. No one would even know he was there. Hit him with the thingy. Hit him with the, the science thingy in the corner there. Your extension of that old fool Gruber's work is really quite brilliant. Ah, nothing good's gonna become of him. You'll see. Just wait. Patience. I can be patient. Smash his head into it. Do something. You can't let him get away with it. This is a horror movie. It's green light for you. Magnificent. Here he goes. I hope when he hits him, he says, you can't have it or something. I hope he's got a good line. He better have a good line. Yes, I will be famous. Oh my, it was so much harder than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> I didn't know what I expected. It was so much worse. It's so bad. And it... Dangerous. Oh. Ah. Ah. He did get his little cheeky line in, though, which we like. It's a lot of guts. Oh, reanimate just the head and be like, sucker. Sucker. Oh, the spaghetti. We put him on a spike. Reanimate just the head. Just to, just out of curiosity. Yes. Yes? I've never done whole parts. Same wavelength. Yes! Yes! Oh, that's such a clean, that's so clean! You can see the spinal cord, you see everything! Wow, imagine if you could just reanimate individual parts. Like, think of what that would do for surgeries and, you know, it would change the game. This is such important research. You know, he died for the cause. He was also a bad man. Subject really leans into the S's. <laughs> Poor guy. He's ashamed in the corner. You know, he's sad. He's sad, really. Oh, this been lobotomized. Oh. You did sign away. All right. She won't make that mistake again. <laughs> this is not good. <gasps> Truly a not good situation for him. The head's gonna be gone. It's gonna be a body roaming around, holding a head like this, probably. Didn't bother to kill him though. Didn't bother to finish the job. Interesting. 
Hill took my serum, my notes, everything. Herbert, you're insane. Now what happened? I had to kill him. He's dead. Not anymore. Not anymore. Oh, no, 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 no. Jinx. Jinx. Try to blackmail me, Dan. No, it doesn't matter. I didn't want you to disappear. He's in the little tray. Uh, am I to believe that this headless uh, teacher collected everything that he needed and while carrying the head? We suspend our disbelief for the movies. The sound effects really are visceral. <laughs> bring me, bring me a drink, you fool. Oh. He's making soup, like for blood soup, so he can stay hydrated. That makes sense, right? Because he's probably losing a lot of blood. Pats him? I hope he pats him. No, he's just gonna slop him about. <laughs> You're leaving a mess. <sighs> Finally, someone who, who's in worse shape than I am. I thought he couldn't hear anything through that glass. What are you saying to him? Is he what's he supposed to understand from this? It's time. It what you talk about now. Sorry. What's this? Oh goodness me. Hmm. Yeah. Nothing to see here. You recognize me, surely? Oops. Is that you, Dr. Hill? Yes, it's me. Don't disrupt me while I'm reading my nudie mags. Great time. It's a good little, cute little setup with the head. How are you seeing? Muscle memory. It's better. <laughs> suffocating in there he's still so sloppy underneath he's like growing roots but they're not roots they're just various guts ah he looks like a plant that needs to be potted ah. what are you doing i wanted so much to hate you <laughs> so dumb! Oh, he's been unleashed. He gave him a lobotomy in such a way that it made him a zombie that he has control over to beat up the boyfriend so that he can get with the daughter. Only the best surgeons. What are you doing? Ah. Uh. Not good, I will say. He's got a little zombie army, doesn't he? Ugh, look at his sl sloppy neck. Someone shove him. He needs a shove. Oh, come on. Avert your gaze. Avert your gaze. Sneaky little perv. Getting an eyeful. Don't mind him. Dan? Dan? Dan, wake up. Dan, you're needed. Oh, well, you'll be all right. Meg. This guy's this guy better die in an even more gruesome way than he already died. He will. He will. She won't. I'm very disappointed in you. You're not even a second-rate scientist. Get him. Put him down. You'll never get credit for my discovery. Who's going to believe a talking head? Get a job in a sideshow. 
why an intelligent young man like yourself should make such a foolish, fatal mistake. You are at a major disadvantage, sir. I have a plan. So do I. That's a lot of zombies. So that's actually a lot of zombies. More than I thought. They're so strong once they're reanimated is the problem. They're so strong. It's a big issue. Makes possible a new technique in lobotomy. Results in total mastery of the human will. Okay, so that is pretty impressive when you think about it. Look at me! <laughs> oh, the dad's gonna the dad's gonna come through. The power of love saves the day. <laughs> now he's seen everything. Yeah, do something to his head. Punch it or something. Or smash it into your own head. Kick it like a football. Throw it in the garbage. Spitballing. Or squish it between your own two hands. Take your own hands and score! Oh, so many such things! Ah, that's a lot of that. That's so much eye eyeballs. Plumber dolls! No! Or just chop him up. Yeah, I guess overdose. Or chop him up. Oh, these bare hands. Oh, the gut, the brains, the guts. <sighs> I must say, the guts in this movie are on a, on a whole other level. <laughs> Not the large intestine coming out to choke him, surely. His whole body is rallying. All of his vital organs are rallying to kill him. <sighs> wow. Or is that his spine? That looks like maybe his spine that got him. No, no, no. Grab him. Save him. S snap it. Oh, the poor... The dad really came through. No way. <laughs> Help him. Help him. Come on, get the bag. Where is he getting sucked into? Where is he getting sucked into? His body, his torso? <laughs> This is really just a zombie movie at heart. Oh. <laughs> such, such things. What is that? <laughs> this does feel like a time to take the stairs. This is an emergency after all. <laughs> I'll be right back. Oh, one sec. Otherwise, you're gonna need a bit more of that juice. <laughs> Don't miss, that's okay. All right. She died. Use the reanimation juice. It's not too late. Get her. Hit her with the juice. Oh my God, it's a flashback to the beginning. Just a touch of the juice, she's still fresh. All right, time to see about this character arc, right? Hey, hurry, hurry, she's got enough. It's the same doctor from the beginning. <sighs> she never gets a break, never gets to go home. And that is the real horror of this movie. Hurry, hurry. <sighs> but you thought I wasn't gonna do one. Okay, I'm ready off. <laughs> Clear. Clear. Avert your gaze. Nothing. Hit her with the palms. It's too slow. You have to do it to stay in alive. Much faster than that. You can tell by the way, you know, it's gotta be faster. Right? Okay. Ah. It's okay. 
Honey, I have just the thing. True love's kiss. This poor guy, eh? I mean, since it's here. Remember what I taught you, taught you, taught you. He hears it in the back of his head. This will go well. I love okay. You. Okay. Get to it. Wow. Great shot. Wow. Whew. Well, that was great. That you know what that reminded me of? That reminded me of Pet Cemetery in so many moments. Right? I won't wreck Pet Cemetery for you if you haven't seen it. If you haven't seen it, you should check it out with me. Just the idea of reanimating and then it not really going as planned. The people not really returning uh, as they left. But I thought it was also really original, a really original take on it. The guts in this movie were on a whole new level. It was a lot of little flappy pieces and a lot of gushing. It was like a lot of it. And throwing things at the wall and then having little pieces of them stick on the wall and then drop. That happened more than once and it was epic. I really like practical effects. I'm tickled by them. I always want to know how they made them. Like how did they, like I want to be on a team of specialists who is in charge of making gore. Like I want to be on the team of people who's like, okay, so here's what, okay. Here's what's gonna happen in this scene. You're gonna grab the brain, and then you're gonna whip it at the wall. And when you do, there's gonna be a little piece that sticks on the wall, and that's gonna fall to the ground. And hey, sound department, I wanna hear a I wanna hear that, okay? So you you got that? Okay, go, go do that. Everyone know what they're doing? <laughs> I just feel like that'd be such a creative job. It really does make the movie. When you're making a movie, and you know there's gonna be gore in it, you better be thinking, who are the best people? because it makes or breaks, and it all looks so real. <sighs> well, I give Reanimator 10 slimy severed head spaghetti. This out of 10, ah, we all saw that ending coming from a mile away, right? This is, this is nice. Thank you so much for watching that with me. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. It really helps me a lot and it tells me that you want me to watch more of these. And speaking of more of these, if there's another movie that you want me to watch, leave it in the comments. I read all of them. It's where I go to get my movies. I'm gonna go for a walk now. But you should watch another one of my videos because this was sloppy, sloppy and fun. <laughs> See you soon.